Welcome everyone to an arena video. This is Andrea Melucci. This video is sponsored to you by channelfarball.com and Ultimate Guard. We'll be playing the standard metagame challenge with um, the four color Omnath deck. That's very popular these days in uh, in Magic. And uh, I'll be doing that with uh, the list that my good friend Dylan Donegan won the standard challenge with, and it's uh, the attack of Ruin Crab. Ruin Crab is attack for the mirror match, as uh, you want to deck your opponent out, <laughs> funnily enough, because you will have Regenerate Ultimatum and Escape the Wilds to edge in the mirror match, but if the opponent deck is getting thinner and thinner, they will not be able to accomplish that plan. The deck is uh, very, very strong, and it's very likely going to be nerfed or banned uh, this afternoon with the ban list, but you know, today we still have that. You can still play with it, and um, the deck is playing 26 plus 7 spell lands, so really a lot of those. And uh, yeah, I mean, that's just let's just get down to the game. This deck is at this point pretty popular. The main plan of the deck is to ramp, get your Omnath, escape the wild, Genesis Ultimatum out, and uh, keep on running, keep on running with the game until uh, until your opponent just kind of kind of kind of runs out. And yeah, this this deck, this event is very very good value. Okay, new new league year. I'll be keeping this hand. It's not the fastest, no Cobra, but still keep. Will banning Uro will stop this deck? I play one Uro, only one in the deck. So if you think that banning a card you're playing one of will stop anything, it's um, it's kind of strange, right? Uh, yeah, Spike Philosoph is a great draw here. Is a tour tour sound on? It was Corey. Didn't you hear? Didn't you not hear the tour tour sound? Have you tried Blue Black Control? This is the first match that I play in standard. Since Zendikar Rising, I had to craft it all. So I kill that 1 1. They have a Destiny Spinner in play. Lotus Cobra comes in right on time. I think I will go for Cultivate. Um, I'll get Forest and I'll get the Island here. Thank you, Corey. Pepe D. Pepe D. Pepe D. All right. Thank you very much, Corey. I hope I hope, I hope you heard the sound, the, the tu -du -tu -du sound. Do 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 do. I'll choose white, and I will not play Omnath. That's good enough, though. Next turn, we will we'll go five to six with the ultimatum, and that will be hopefully the win. They kill my Cobra. They draw Mountain now. I mean, even with just the fight spell, Green has access to fight spell. Chandra Spiral Healing, nice. What did this get? 4-4 four, four mana, so I'm taking 6 here. Oh, blocks. Okay, so now as long as I don't play the planes, I'll be good to go. Uh, Actually though, should I crack this Fibble Passage? Probably not, right? No, I don't want to. So we're gonna go River Glade Pathway, get Chachinque Seiset. So I'll go River Glade Pathway, Actually, I might do the... Ah, oh, no, that's fine. So, River Glade Pathway up the mountainside. Sure, and I have to get green mana. Green mana, and then I'll cast the ultimate of Bam. See what I find. Okay, I find these cards, which aren't the best cards ever. But yes, it's alright. How uh, much mana do I get? I already made my land drop. So, this one moves three cards. I don't even know... <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know why it's in the deck, but all right, all right, it's, it's in there, it's in there. So I can go, I can just cycle my my triome here. Uh, yeah, it's, that's it. I'll pause the turn. Get ready for another one. Do, 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 yeah, I mean, if you do have uh, lots of wild cards, I think crafting uh, Omnath and Cobra is a smart thing to do because. There's a chance there that could be banned, and at that point you would get the, the wild cards, you know, the wild cards back, and you can play still them in historic because they won't ban them in historic, or at least they won't ban in historic now. I I don't know actually. I mean, it's it depends on much, it depends on much 
wild cards you have. If 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 you have enough and you know you, you used to play with these like Timur decks, you sh you should probably do that. Because I didn't I didn't craft them. I was like I'll I'll wait. But then I figured, nah, I mean, why 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 wait? All right, I think I have to block here. Hello, because I'm gonna Whenever a source you control this damage, I think I'm just afraid because this guy gets get, this guy gets double strike. But I don't know if I should. So this is six damage. I mean, I'm definitely blocking with a ring crop because I really don't care about that. Not a bad. Let's just take this. So if they go if they go Ember Cleave, I take 10, 12, and I die. Man, I don't want to die. I don't want to die, chat. All right, I think I have a, I think I have a block. Why is there a rune crab in this deck? I don't know why there's a rune crab in this deck. It's strange, right? It's strange that there's a rune crab in this deck. The thing, the thing is that, from what I've heard on Twitter, is good in the mirror match. Because, I, I don't know why it's good in the mirror. I, I guess, all right, all right. I'll go land, land, cobra. Trixie. Blue, 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 verde, rosso, okay. Thank you, Dr. Goldhead, my favorite doctor of the stream here. So I'm gonna grab green, because they're on the blue, you know? see. I'm gonna grab green and red. See. And now I cast Genesis Ultimatum, and I reveal three lands, but I draw two Escape the Wild. So I should safely win this game this turn by milling my opponent out. But let's just make sure it all goes accordingly. I'm just gonna add her some random mana. I hope it'll, get, I hope it'll be good enough eventually. All right, casting Escape the Wild. I have made only one land drop here. A well, they've made one land drop here, so I'll probably play this land. Then I'll go glass pool mimic on the ruin crab. My opponent has 42 cards in the deck. Can I mill 42 cards? Probably, right? Pretty easily. Uh, now I'm fetching this Fable Passage. Probably is actually not have enough basics now that I think about it. I didn't think that was a problem. This is my first game with the deck and um, I don't know, we'll see if uh, that ends up being a problem. Should I just grab all my basics land now? I probably should, although I would miss out on more crabs, so maybe, yeah, maybe I just should wait on the crabs here. All right, so here, what can I do? I have no clue how many land drop I've left, but thankfully that's not a problem, because Magic Arena tells you. I did draw an Omnath, but this shouldn't... Mm. Mm. So here, what should my what should be my order? Opponent has 36 cards in the deck. I probably should have just copied a, a cobra, not a crab. So I'm gonna get white and blue. But I wanna just go for a lotus cobra, but I don't know if I wanna go with I think I'm just gonna grab the last basic land in my deck. So I don't want to risk to draw it. So I'm gonna go red and green so I can cast the Omnath. Red and green so I can cast the Omnath here. Mm. So that one draws me a card. And now I can play a mountain, trigger Omnath. Gain four life. Mill six cards. And I'm gonna get blue for sure. But I'm also gonna get well, red is fine. It looks like I have expired all my land drop. 
Although I do have Uro. Hmm. So what can I do here is cast in Uro. Draw a card. Put a land from hand. The Fable Passage, I don't have any basic land left in the deck. So I just have to play this planes, which will trigger the four mana from the Omnath. And I'll be keep on milling. I'll put us 12 cards in the deck. I'm gonna get a bit, uh, green and blue. Now, uh, my opponent has 12 cards in the deck. I'm gonna play a Ruin Crab. I am going to. So 12 means that if I just play a Mimic. Actually, yeah, can I play a Mimic? So the Cultivate doesn't give me any basics. I don't have any basic left lands left. So I'm just playing this Escape the Wild, leaving some blue and red mana in my pool. I'll make one lane drop, kill my opponent board. Oh no, sorry, just deal four damage to your opponent. I thought this was also the creature. Oh, it's Planeswalkers. See, I didn't know that. All right, how much how many lands am I putting as in the deck? Still three cards in the deck. So I have to make an additional land drop. Can I make that additional land drop? Yes, I can. All right, Rod of the Lysian Grove will help me make an additional land drop here <clears throat> and win the game. I miss lethal. Did I, Oli Lasagna? All right, how many lands have Okay, so I can pass the turn here. I didn't read the chat while I was doing this. How did I how did I miss lethal chat? I oh how Okay, okay, this was a good game. Thank you very much for playing. Um let's sideboard now. How am I going to sideboard in the aggressive matchups? Let me check. <laughs> Versus Gruel and Red. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Okay, so I'm gonna bring in Elder Gargaroth, Strom's Wrath, and Red Kamele. And I'm going to board out the Genesis Ultimatums, which did me win me the game, so I can cut a couple of crabs, the Genesis Ultimatums. I guess one clone. I don't like a Cobra. I guess I can cut one Cobra. I guess I'll cut one more clones. Clone does seem pretty bad. Do, 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 do. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, Vertaro, I actually don't know. I think who started with Sam Rolf, and I just saw this list on Twitter, and I was like, all right. I mean, I wasn't planning on playing this deck, but when I saw the crabs, I, I, I was like, oh, there's crabs in standard? I want to play it. Okay, uh, yeah, I mean, I have lines and spells I'm going to keep. Yeah, the crab, the crab emoji is nice. Hello, the Paku. Uh, 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 I'm still playing this land. That's the turn. You don't want to play plane. I guess I couldn't play planes this game because it boarded out all the. A kid creature gets plus two, plus two, and has X proof. Whenever a creature with that touch blocks or becomes blocked, pepega, pepega, pepa. Uh, am I going to grab island? I think I'll wait on the Fable Passage. Okay, I am going to cast, I think Cultivate. Maybe I should have cast, maybe I should have cast uh, Dryad, I don't know. I just feel like I don't want to cast Dryad when it done it. But maybe, maybe I should have cast Dryad, who knows. Arasta, 4 out of 3, 5 or each. I cast this was so nice, it's a cool card. I think I'm gonna cast Dried of the Lysian Grove. Play two lands. And cast Cultivate. And get two islands. 
Mm -mm -mm. And then I get ready next turn to cast Escape the Wild. Plus three cards. Mm -mm. Yeah, I think I'll go no blocks. Yeah, I can maybe safely block the spider, but I don't want to lose the dryad. Spikefield Azard. So I'm going to play Escape the Wilds here. Mm, perfect. So here, what I can do is, I have to make two additional land drops. So I can make one land drop, two land drop. Play the Omnath. And then I can make an additional land drop because I haven't made it yet. Elder Gargaroth, okay. Uh, yeah, this can make this fine. Whatever. Mm, add the mana, right? I don't remember which level I'm on right now. Second level, so add five mana right now. So I can go skip the wild. And this is my first time playing with this deck. Yeah, I mean, uh, playing the Solitaire is fun. Uh... Scorching Dragonfire on my Omnath. No, poor Omnath. This is my second run. Earlier I lost. I lost in the first round to the mirror match. This match I won't lose. Go for blood. That's an interesting card. No, I misclicked. No, I misclicked chat. All right. Uh, wait. Don't they, don't they ask you for like? Don't they ask you for like? Do you want to pass the turn? I th I thought I would ask you. Hey, you have mine in your pool. I got four life. Oh, and I only got four life. Oh, I see. I didn't get the mana. Oh, cause I only, oh, it was only the first level. Sure. That's right. I I was only on the first level. On all on MTGO. Yeah. That is true. Okay. I drew Lotus Cobra. That, that should make things more fun. So I cast Lotus Cobra. Now I'll play Escape the Wilds. All right, I think I'll just start timing out people, especially the one that I have never seen on this channel before. I'm just tired of those messages. <laughs> if you guys want to say things, all right, just say, but that will be, your, you know, the last time that you'll say those things that I just couldn't care the, the less of. Oh, Lord. Um, I think I'll play the crab. I think playing crab is cool. Okay, now, what am I doing here? I definitely want to cast Escape the Wilds. Ooh, look at my triggers. I want to crack Fable Passage here. I don't know how many basics I've left. This this deck is running out of lands a lot. It's, I mean, maybe maybe whenever whenever I'm running out of lands, it doesn't mean anything because I'm winning. So. Oh wow, you killed my you killed my crab? That's that's just nasty. That's just that's just nasty opponent. Chat, my opponent killed my crab. My mom I'm a big fan of crabs. I like to. I like to eat crabs. My opponent also appreciated the crab. Uh, but you know, let's add a mana. Okay, I don't know which level I'm on, but I'll be casting an Escape the Wild here. Oh no, the Arasta makes the tokens. Okay, I've I've no clue. I'm no clue what I'm supposed to do here. I, I'm just gonna draw cards into play. All right, 
I am just actual factual dragging cards into play right now. Is that okay? Why wow, add more land drops? I'll go green mana. Okay. <laughs> I have no clue how many land drops I have. Oh, I have more land drops. Okay. <laughs> more land drops? All right, I guess I ran out of lands. Oh, you can't make this as a land? No, I ran out of land drops. That's a shame. I can play a three drop though. Uh, all right, that's the end of my turn, opponent. I'll attack with my creatures. With us. Yeah, no, no more land drop sucks. I thought this deck has uh, it's like you know fast bond. You know the card fast bond chat? Have you ever heard of it? It's um, it's this card for for those of you who never heard of it. Uh, attenzione though, because they put a brush down over here. I don't want to. I don't want to be. I don't want to be scared, but I kind of am right now because I don't know what's going on. And uh, and my opponent has fifty nine cards in the deck. Check that out. My opponent boarded in extra cards to play around my mill plan. That 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 might be a powerful strategy, honestly. Attenzione, chat. Attenzione for real. Attenzione for real, huh? You you never know, cause you know things th things can get rough over there. So this card says, uh, "An arrow creature with death control is going to love to destroy that creature." Right, I shouldn't be any yeah. And uh, X proof again. Okay. And um, mm. yeah, I think I wanna I just kill that Arasta. I wanna kill Arasta here. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I got eighteen. Uh, let's go rack up melee on the Arasta. See, it's a sacrifice this evolving wilds. Hmm. I draw. Okay. Uh, what am I doing here? Um. Mm -mm -mm. So this card deals me four damage if I block it, if I attack with it. But I think it's all right because my opponent is on ten. Okay. This one deals one to the face. I think I'm attacking with uh, my creatures. I don't know, it's so close. Sorry, it's so close. It's so cold. Why so cold? It's still September. Tio Bono. Mm. So they're on six. And they take four damage. Now, how am I supposed to do things here? Um, Omnath. I don't have any land drop, which is a, which is a, maybe an issue. Maybe, should I play Omnath? No, right? No, let's go, just, just go escape the wild first. That's just always a nice way to start a turn. Okay, so I can go Lotus Cobra. Always Lotus Cobra. Now I can go land trigger. I don't know what's the first level is four life. Yeah, you know, never mind four life. It's all right. If I'm in the planes. Mm, okay, now I have to get to the second level because I need to. I should the third level. I have to get to the third level, right? Allora, um, lo facciamo rosso e blu. Mm. I have to get the third level here, so let's get to the third level. Right. Now, you take four, you're on two life. E... What's next? Uh, what's next? This is over, right? It doesn't have any more levels, so we can play a new Omnath. See? So now I need to restart everything, right? To restart everything. I bet I can't restart everything because I don't have any more lands. I'll just play all, uh, Uro. Eh. Uh... Oh, Spike is a land. It, it is a land, but this doesn't deal any damage, right? This only deals four life. Oh, so I have one, two land. Does I need a third one? Hmm. True. So what I'm doing is playing this as a land to trigger the first chapter of the Omnath. Thank you, Jawadi. 
Oh, I have evolving wilds in play. That's that's neat. I didn't think consider that. Thank you very much, Jawadi, for gifting a sub to Yanos. You've gifted 44 sub. That's a lot, my friend. Thank you so much for the support. As I am shooting now my opponent. Alright, this was my first. No, Kume, I've I've run out of land drops. Wow. I didn't expect it. Oh no, chat. I've run out of land drops. Oh no, I'm s I ran out of land drops. What am I supposed to do now? Oh yeah, yeah. Eh, Vabin. Thank you, thank you, Jawadi, as always. Eh, all right, then. I, since I've run out of land drops, I just have to play cards. That's a shame. Oh, but I can keep the old one. Maybe I draw land. I did draw land, but I already made the land drop, so. I should have I should have cloned the Dryad. Yeah, maybe. Ah. Uh, all right. I guess I'll uh, I'll just I'll just play cards and pass the turn. Actually, maybe I can draw something that makes me a land drop. Wow, I have less than twelve minutes on the clock. Jeez. I'll pass the turn. Red Cup Ura twice a replay. Ooh, that's a true. That's true, Allo Cub. I didn't consider that line. I should have Red Cup Melee Ura twice and then escape it. That is right. I just see what I do because they're fighting with my Uro. I'm taking six damage over here. Check that out. Bam. Okay, will I will I make or will I make my my necessary land drop to win this time? Because I only yeah I think I have three land drops, so it's, it's okay I can do it. Oh, ruin crab! But my opponent overboarded lands so that I can beat my ruin crab land. That's very smart of them. Opponent opponent is very smart. Actually, do I have any land drops left? Sorry, do I have any land left? I think I do. So that's the second chapter. E I win. All right, great victory from, it took me 15 minutes to win this game. 15 minutes almost, and I basically played a solitary, but that's all right. It was worth it. I have lands and spells, that'll be a keep. Perfect mana base. This seems like an Ikoria draft. An Ikoria draft right here. Do, 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 do. Good morning, Dallas Streaming. Yeah, the previous match has been fun. The previous match has been fun. Nahiri Little Form. What is that? Broccoli Forest, your go. Oh, Merfolk, Wind Robber. Wind Robert. Should I play the Sketcher Triome? Eh, I don't think so. There's a world where uh, maybe I don't draw any spell after Cultivate, so I want to cycle the Sketcher Triome. Oh no, my Crab! I think it's fun to put Crab in your deck, just to mix things up. Just to mix things up a bit. Just to be like, hey, hey, look out, I only play, all right. So here, I'll go for uh, Island and Forest. I don't need to play. Unfortunately, my list only runs one Oro. I wish I could have more Oro. I guess it's... I don't know. I skipped a wild I've been milled. No. And I suck this to draw card already. Ooh. See, I knew I was going to just flood out and I needed to cycle. Alright, I'm going to cycle with whatever lands the client tell me to live up. Attenzione, uh, attenzione chat. I have drawn the crab. The crab has been drawn, ladies and gentlemen. The crab has been drawn. Once you draw the crab, there's just no comeback here. Might just play forest here, sure. 
How to tap her new? Game is over. You mill three cards. How can you? How can you do this now, opponent? You wanna mill me? I am milling you. Imagine chat. Imagine chat. My opponent want to mill me. You know, we're crap. We're you know. You can you can mill Mango Zero now. Eh? Let's see who has the better meal plan. Basically, standard right now has become a meal party. Oh no, they also have the crab! Oh my! They knew! They knew the tech! Opponent is aware, is aware of the tech of Ruin Crab. Oh my god. You know the, the, the meme with Spider Man, you know, pointing fingers at each other? That's the, that's the crab. That's the crab. Oh my, opponent. Opponent knows the drill uh how many basics do i have left because i might have not that many basics left all right let's just uh let's just let's just cycle another triome i did see when it grown escape the wild i opponent do i'm milling three cards now how does it feel how does it feel opponent to be milled by three cards uh, are we attacking no let's let's not attack Gas Blessing? Gas Blessing was reprinted recently. Where, when when was it reprinted, actually? I think I'm fetching. I don't want my plan to mill my mountain. Because if, if they mill my mountain... Wait, actually, how many islands have left? How many islands have left? One island? Jeez, if they mill the island, they can't play Ultimatum? Can you imagine that, chat? Wow, oh, Sphinx's Tutelage, for real. Sphinx's Tutelage is here. Alright, don't mill the island. Oh, forest. Wow, so close. <laughs> All right. Hmm. I wonder if... Oh, no. Merfolk Queen Robber. I wonder if they play Counter Magic in their deck. Do they? Oh, hopefully not. I'm gonna go Fable Passage. Mill you for three. Grab the last island of the deck. And then Stratabram. Oh, mill three, sorry, I forgot to say that. How can I forget about my boy Ruin Crab here? Okay, can I flip like five lands? Would love to flip five lands here. Actual factual five lands. <gasps> no! No, I tried to bounce my crab! Oh no! How can I do this now? They bounced my crab! Porca boya. Ah, that's a shame. That that's 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 really bad news. That's really bad news, isn't it? We stopped pishing the door so that's a bad news as well. Are right, gonna cast a crab? My plant is very nasty. Very nasty, you know, they wanted to take the crab. Alright, alright, the crab is back. Mill three, please. Hmm. Then I cast cultivate. And I grab the two last basics, or one last basic, sorry. Yes, that goes in play. Trigger, mill three opponent. Hmm, sorry, I'm a... I have 25 cards, looking to be 23 here. It's a wire disruption. Attention, because my deck is getting thin, but they will, they'll ne their deck will get thinner, I'll tell you that. Pondering Rebuke? Oh no, my crab! Why is my opponent so mean to my crabs? I all, all, I still have I still have two crabs left in my deck. Stop me in my crab. Stop me in my crab opponent. I'll block. Don't me my crabs. Okay, the crabs are still in there. Nice. Draw spec field azard. Ah yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright. Let's get in let's get in with a Genesis Ultimatum. Flip, man. I want to flip two crabs. There's no crabs? Omnath? Wait, did I even play Omnath? I didn't know that. I didn't know I was playing Omnath. Draw? Genesis Ultimatum. Alright, Omnath draws. I didn't know I was playing this card. What's this, what's this card does again? 4 mana 4-4. Four, four. Okay. I have done some triggers and I draw a card. Okay, thank you. Oh, Glass Pool of Mimic. Glass Pool of Mimic. Interesting. Uh, where are them crab at, chat? Where are, the, where are the crabs at? Oh, come on! Where are my crabs? 
Aww. Uh, what do we copy? I'll copy the... What am I, what am I returning, actually? What am I putting into play right now? Hmm. I can copy a glass pool mimic and choose the new Omneth. All right, I will do that. So I will choose the new Omneth here, which will trigger again all the time. I have 11 card left in my deck, which isn't very many, I can tell you that. The opponent has 25 cards in the deck. Hey, you porca merda, I have all the crabs in there. How many lands are left? Only two lands are left. Buta male, chat. Have I ever tell you how, how much it buta male? And also, why did I misclick? Porca boia. Attenzione, chat, because I might lose this game. You know, we're laughing here and there, but we are, might lose this game. Tortellino badge. Silva Buffo. Good job in the tort... Achieving the Tortellino badge. And while you achieve the Tortellino badge here, your friend Mango Zeranove might just lose the game. It might. It might happen. So I'll just have to pass the turn here. You have to shuffle your library. Wait, how do I how do I do that? So crabs are not on top. Wait, how why the crabs are on top? How do, how do you know that? You see the bottom cards of your library? How? By cheating? All right, my opponent is milling three cards of my deck. That is a shame. Don't mill the crabs. Okay, they milled only one crab. So I still have one crab left in the deck. I mean, there are There is the fireball, the crabs. It's just that they killed them all. I have one crab left, and I have three lands in end. Sir Barbafo. Trotrio badge. Yeah, it's pretty cold today, for real. I, you know what I want, chat? Actually, I might, I might, I might bring that back. La mia borsa dell'acqua calda. Where is it? Oh, it's here. Nice. It survived. It survived all the summer in the closet. The water, hot water pot. I don't know how you call it. Also, I should really go to the toilet. I don't know if I have time to do that. Anyway, ah, mamma mia, che freddo. Allora, I have seven cards in my deck. No, but for real, I have seven cards in my deck, and they have 24. I don't think I can win. I don't think I can use the Spike Field Hazard on that. I just have to go to five here. Hot water bottle. It's not a bottle, though. It's like a thing. That yeah, I'll take two damage. You don't have to mill my you don't have to mill my, my crab or I just have no way to win the game. That's just as easy as that. Terra? No crab. Okay. I have five cards left. And I'll put them all into play next turn. Thunder and rebuke on my own. Tutto tuo. Attenzione. I think we can still do this. So I'll draw for turn. There is the crab, so I'll play it. Now, I have four lands. Allora. I think I'll play Escape the Wild. Reveal all my deck. So my deck is into play right now. Now, I have to play Glass Pool Mimic here. And then I can make three land drops. That'll be 18 lands. I think I can only mill 18 lands, chat. I think I can only mill 18 lands here. So I'll copy a crab. Then I'll play this as a land. Say, I think it's just 18 lands, chat. It's 18 lands. Corey, no draft today? Um, I don't know, should I play draft? It's just that I wanted to play this event because of, uh, you know, Standard metagame challenge is very good value. Plus, I mean, it's not a deck that's gonna be here to the, tomorrow. I might have miscalculated, and my opponent is actually dying here. Wow, I think I have lost the game because I don't know why they conceded chat. I don't know why they conceded. They committed suicide. I'm going to the bathroom. Okay. Okay, chat. Who who even needs sideboarding, right?
Okay, this is my water, my hot water thing. Oh, I feel so good. Oh, I miss this. I miss this tremendously. Ah, I feel so good. Ah. Hello, I keep. You know, this is probably the day where I feel like summer is officially over. And it's, yeah, it, it is, it is officially over. It is cold. It, it is. Today it's cold. Like yesterday, I mean, yesterday was raining. Yesterday was raining, you know? So when it rains, it feels like it's all right because, you know, it's raining. So it's cold because it's raining. But, but today is not raining. Today there's like sun outside. Like it's very good. It's very good. You know, it's a, just a very good day. Oh no, they can't kind of my crab chat. How can we do this now? Tio Bono, my opponent just hates my crabs. I guess they want to be like the only crabs around. Hulk stun H. Thank you very much to Hulk stand H for the sub. What land am I getting here? You, you're very close to the to the Tortellino badge, like like Sir Barbafo. Tortellino badge, best badge around. Uh, I'm playing this Lotus Cobra, and I think I want to just pick this Merfolk Wind Robber. <sighs> Although I probably just couldn't care less about a Merfolk Wind Robber child. What am I talking about? What am I even talking about? Aspetta un attimo, I can go. No, I can't. Dai, vabbè, I'll just play a top land and pass the turn. Did you miss the rigged away? Uh, you didn't, Sephiroth. You didn't. Hello, Saint Nutritious. Sphinx is tutelage. Sorry, Teferi is tutelage, okay. And they mill me two cards. And they time me for one. And they me one card. Alright. Ay, 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 opponente. The ruined crab has arrived, ladies and gentlemen. No one can escape the ruined crab. Just no one. No one can. No one. No one has ever. Pro no, probably. You know what, chat? Probably has, no one has ever escaped it. Like, the only few people that have escaped it. Hmm, should we go, should you play like a boring Omnath or a fun Escape the Wild while milling my opponent? Oh, milling is nice. Green. I land. Trigger, trigger. Red. And then we'll escape from the wild here. On the trois quatre cinq, Tova. All right. I can't just. I just have to play one land, right? Yeah, I think so. Let's play this. You mill three. Next turn, if we untap with a crab, it'll be over. For sure, we can mill them out easily. <laughs> Almost boring it is, but crab is fun, so we're crabbing them. We are crabbing. Ah, it's so nice. Oh no, they draw a card. Look at that value over there. Yeah, spam this crab to help out Gab. Okay. Do you know, chat, that back in the days, my team, MTG Band Card, used to have this hoodie. I, I can show it to you. MTG Band Cards. I can show it to you. You can see here, uh, MTG Band Cards was um, was their team in 2016-2017, and uh, it was uh, it was Mikal, Anthony Lee, Javier Dominguez, Michael Bonde, and Corey ba and Corey Baumeister. And the, our our logo was this hand, you know, it was like a hand like this that was like flipping a card, but it felt like a crab in our hoodie. So we always had this like meme that we were doing the crab thing, 
uh, whenever whenever we're using this this hoodie. It was 2016, 2017. So yeah, well, what, what, whenever some of us were doing well, we were doing the crap thing. All right. Okay, now, now what should we do? I think Omnath isn't good. Imagine people wanted to ban Omnath, lol. Um, I think I'll play Escape the Wild here. Copy the crab and ramp. I don't think I can do all of that. Okay. Now I can play one land from here. And I'll let green mana. You mill throw in the meanwhile. Green. Perfect. Now I can go Cobra. Sure. Now I have... Uh, this is my last land drop to make if I'm not wrong, if I'm not if I'm not mistaken. I could be easily mistaken here. So I can go I have to go green and uh oh, vabbè dai, facciamo blue. Hey, I ran out of land drops. So I could go cultivate I don't want to mimic my crab just yet. I'll, I'll have time to mimic my crab, right? It's a free spell. It's not free. I didn't have a. I didn't have more lands to cast. I didn't have more land drop to make unless I would have done uh, an escape the wild, right? Like you just go omnath, and then you. If you only have one land drop, which I didn't have extra land drops, I only have one land drop there, so I just gain for life. But I don't care about gaining for life. You know what I mean? Like I do play Omnath if uh, if I have an extra land drop to make, but I didn't have an extra land drop to make there. Play around dispute. I'm sorry, hidden fifty. We don't play around things here. I just I just click buttons. Cultivate was available. Hmm. Wasn't cultivate. Hmm. Maybe, maybe it was. This deck is hard to play. It might be the black goat. The thing is that sure it is hard to play, but most of the time maybe it doesn't matter. But I don't know. I'm I'm in ju I'm just here because I think that playing this crab is fun. When, when I saw this list of crab, I was like, oh, I want to mill my opponent because that's a fun thing to do. I don't really care. Um, how many cards do you have, opponent? Twenty eight. That's a lot of cards. Can I just go Omnath and Ultimatum here? Quattro, tre, cinque, tre, sette. Si, 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 si. Yo puedo, chat. Yo puedo jugar Omnath and Ultimatum. Si, 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 si. Draw a card, thank you very much. Attenzione! No, I think I'm still, still going for the Omnath Ultimatum here. So play this mountain. Trigger, trigger, trigger. I'll grab blue and green. Si, 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 si. Si, 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 si. Blue and green and that's my official ultimatum if you target if you counter target spell i don't care or maybe i should care but i won't all right and that's two damage sorry four damage to you do, 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 do. shark typhoon ma come shark typhoon porca boya chat my opponent shark typhoon to me drew a card me only two cards that's a shame. That's a shame. Did I just run out of gas here? I am just kind of clicking buttons at this point because I thought I was winning. Turns out I might not. Who knows? We don't. We don't hit it. We don't play around stuff here. How many languages do I speak? Only, only Italian or English. Only Italian and English. Found Uro, eh, I don't even know, is that good? Yeah, I guess it's not. Attenzione, attenzione. So if you would draw a card, except for, oh wow. Ah, ay, 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 opponent. Oh, this must be it. I found a second crab. Nobody, I, I repeat, nobody has ever defeated the second crab. How can you, opponent? How can you defeat the second crab? It's just actual factual impossible. I think they'll I think I think they're just forced to ban the crab here. There's just no way out for them at this point. 
loud. Like, how can we still play this game of Magic of the Gathering if crab is still legal? I don't think this. I don't think this is bearable. Fourteen cards in their deck. GG. GG opponente. Land, mill nine, you get six cards in the deck, or whatever, five cards in the deck. Oh, I have money in my pool. I'll have more money in my pool very soon. I'll escape my boy Urio. Exiling the last crabs. And that's it. And that's it, opponent. You will slowly but surely get milled to death. Trigger, 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 trigger. Bam. Wide pepper clap, chat. Wide pepper clap. For the crabs. No, niente, chat. I didn't find a hoodie with the crab. It's pretty old at this point. I have used that hoodie for so long, though. Every time there was a GP, I was you I was using I was using that duty. <gasps> Turtle one crab! Ciao ne Adrian Hernandez. It's been a pleasure meeting you, but you just cannot beat this card. It's just over. That's it. Mountain Farblet Charger. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. I'm for three. I'm Elio for three opponent. You don't even have, you don't even have to target. Don't even need to target. Who needs to target even? We are two and zero. Cra cr we're two we're crab and zero right now. Oh, Lotus Cobra. Lotus Cobra. Nah, I'm just gonna go my dried a meal three. Sorry, I forgot about that. I'm gonna go dried of the Lysian Grove. Then I'm playing Spike Field Hazard as a land. Meal three. Ah ah ah. Look at all that milling. Do -do 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 -do. Impending doom, attenzione, attenzione chat! That's a nice combo that my opponent just accomplished. Achieved, sorry. Allah. Mm. So here I can go Lotus Cobra. Lotus Cobra. Land land, escape the wild. You mill three, remember that? Don't forget that. See? Lend. Red. And we will escape we'll be escaping wild here. On the trois quatre cinq. Did I make all my land drops? I did not make all my land drops. So what I'll be doing is uh just evolving wild a year ago. Imagine think that you're imagine thinking that you've you've done making land drops. What a world. What a world would think that you you've done making land drops. Alright, pause the turn and next turn opponent, I will mill your whole deck. Next turn is my turn five, and I've never not milled my opponent deck on turn five. Every game you mill your opponent deck on turn five. That's just that's just what you do in standard these days. Decks gets milled, chat. Ooh, that's so fun. Ooh! Uh, no blocks, that's all right. Why not crack and give all the wilds this turn? Why? To do what? To, to, to lose mana? Okay, so right now what I can do is... Can I say set? Hmm, okay, um, I think I have to crack this Fable Passage. Um, it, it adds me more mana, right? Does it? It probably doesn't add me any more mana. Oh, but he mills three cards. That's very important. So I will do that. So I skip the wilds, gets cracked. E, I'll get uh, whatever land into play tapped. You mill three. That's very important. And then which lands am I getting? It doesn't matter, right? Then I cast Genesis Ultimatum. And then I go Sprata Track. Trigger, trigger, trigger. Can I repeat it again? Imagine that banning Omnath stops would stop this deck. <laughs> Sorry for the laugh. 
Um, make it Electro Lane drop. I don't have any. That's not lucky. Uh, what am I getting here? I'm getting blue. And I am getting uh, bo bo white. Mm. Now, what's next? What's next? I'll play this as a land. Green. And uh, the Locus of Creation. I think I cast my Locus of Creation here. I was hoping to mill my opponent deck, but I guess I failed. That's a shame. I hate failing. Okay, I will game for life. It's okay. I will take a green mana. Thank you very much. No, I think I will not fail anymore because I've drawn this land. So I will not fail because I'm going to add now four mana thanks to my friend Omnath, Locust of the God. Locust of Creation, sorry. Hmm. How many lands? How many cards? I have 13, Ben. I'm going to go red. She is. I cast Escape the Wild. Mm -hmm. And I want to find... I don't know how many land drops I've left, but I believe it's enough to mill my opponent deck. They're on 13. Trigger, trigger, trigger. Oh, 4 damage. Why not? 10 lands left. Hmm. I'm casting Lotus Cobra. Or maybe maybe Cultivate I should cast. Mm. Okay, I'll go Lotus Cobra. This is turn 5, chat. I mean, what do you do on turn 5? What do you normally would do on turn 5? I don't... I don't know. Maybe, maybe I missed something. But usually on turn 5, the, the, the game ends, right? No? Okay, I don't know if I've left any land drops, but in case I didn't... How many, how many cards left in your deck? Seven. Okay. I'm afraid now that I can mill my deck first before them. How many cards left? 29. Okay, I, I won't mill. I won't get decked. It's okay. I will um, take this land. Do, do, do. Trigger, trigger. One card left. Okay, I will add the blue and red. Uh, what, am I, what are we doing now between... Uh, I think I'll escape the wild. I think it's faster. I think it's faster. Okay, opponent, you're 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 run out of cards in your deck, and I could continue this for a while, but I will I will just I will stop. I could have continued for a very long time, but I decide to put an end on this game, and now I will make my deck heavily worse by sideboarding. You'd be like, come on, Mango, that can't be true. Yes, I will make I will make my deck heavily worse by sideboarding. A common strategy of strategies that usually gets banned is that you you sideboard and your deck gets heavily worse. Yeah, you'll be like, oh that can't be possible. It is it is chat. I mean Elder Gagaroth, it's it's very bad. Like you'd be like, come on, it, it can't be bad. It is. It is, but we're bringing them in because, like, not bringing in Gargaroth against Monorad deck might look fool, but our deck is now much worse than before, I believe. I'm pretty sure. Overkill with more crabs. No, I felt that it was, I felt that it was alright. Oh, we have Curry Crab in our hand. Ciao, ne. Ciao, ne. I think, I think, I think, yeah, I think uh, Elder Gargaroth is worse than Rain Crab. Rain Crab is just broken. It's just one mana moat, like actual moat, which I can't show to you guys because I don't have it. I do not have a I do not have a moat. Normally I have to be like, this is a moat, but I don't have it. So I can't do that. But what can I show to you is a Rain Crab. So Rain Crab is both a moat and just a phage the No, it's not a phage. It just wins the game. <laughs> It'll be tough this time to win on turn five, I think. I'll try my best. What do you think they ban? I think in order to make this get this deck not available, you'll have to ban at least half of the deck. Actual factual half of the deck. Okay, so I'm gonna grab a island. 
Ma come island? Ma come island? Why did I get an island chat? I should have got a forest. Porca boia. I thought he had a forest in play. Alright, never mind. It's more fun to just, you know, punt. A, I'm playing a Ragnarok Trium. I could have gone Forest, Elysian Gross, Pikefield Hazard, or Red Camellia, but I decided, you know what? That's just too easy. I'm just gonna grab a, an island here. I, I don't. I mean, I do have most of the cards off, because I don't have I don't have a moat. I don't know why. Oh no, my crab! Wait, are you killing it? <gasps> no, no, Chad, they kill. No, I can't believe it. My crab has died. No, no, my crab has died. I can't win anymore. I just can't win anymore. I kill, I kill my crab. No. I'm so sad. I'm so sad right now. I mean, I'll I'll just I'll just pour a glass of water in memory of my boy Rowan Crab. Who left us? Our Rowan Crab left us for an impending doom. I don't know what impending doom means, but it feels like it's like a pretty dramatic word. Isn't it? Is an impending doom a dramatic world, chat? It feels like that's like, something incredibly sad. An impending doom. <gasps> Ruin crab shall rise again. Ah. Now, now life makes sense again. Now life makes sense again. A ruin crab is back. Oh, I had an additional land drop. Oh, I forgot. I thought that two lands drop per turn was enough. I forgot I had three land drop on my turn four of the game. I was like, fool of me to forget. What a fool to forget that on turn four of the game I had three extra land drop to make. I will not forget next time. I will not forget next time, shut. Exactly. Spam this crab. No, oh, it's the opposite, right? E che facciamo? Che facciamo? I'll begin with cycling. Oh, that's a boring card to draw. I didn't want to draw it. Hmm. I bet I let's play this. I guess it was smart not to make the extra land drop last turn then. I wanted to win just with crabs and interaction. I didn't I didn't want busted cards. But that's okay. I'll allow it. No, don't concede. It's like I wanted to mill your deck. Please crab. No, no crab. I mean, I'm keeping, but she probably mulligan because there's no crab here. <gasps> no, I played the wrong land. <laughs> it's H2O. Thank you for the Twitch Prime. All right, chat. If you play the crab deck, you be oh no, no, opponent knows what's going on. Oh my god, chat. Opponent knows what's going on. <gasps> this is the third time that, that I faced the crab mirror match, by the way. Like, we're joking here. Maybe, 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 maybe I shouldn't be joking here. Maybe I should just be actually noticing that the Ruin Crab is the best deck, the best card in standard right now. Actual, factual, best card in standard. Although I won the dot roll, so. I'm sorry, opponent, but we need the die roll. Normally, it's one extra land drop for your opponent, but if you win the die roll in the in this mirror match, it's like your opponent has three extra land drop over you. Three extra land drop is too many land drop. 
All right, what are we doing here? I think I'll lure all this Fable Passage. Just kind of cast this forest. Sorry, play this forest. And play Escape to... Oh, Mail 3, sorry. I almost forgot about it. And play Escape to Wilds. Hmm. I'll play an extra land. And that will be my turn. Not the best of the turns. But still fine. <clears throat> Lotus Cobra. Lotus Cobra número 2. Attenzione! Attenzione! Opponent could win the game this turn. Easily. Could easily win the game this turn. Because they play one Fable Passage. So they have access to 5 mana. I mean, one Fable Passage should easily get you access to 5 mana. That's just what cards normally would do. You know, one land is 5 lands. So opponent will get access to 5 mana right now. And can play an Escape the Wild, which can give them access to roughly 17,000 mana. Which can, can play Genesis Ultimatum, which can then mill your opponent deck. This is turn four, and that's just, you know, what you're supposed to do with Magic the Gathering TCG. Although, opponent unfortunately bricked. That's a shame. I'm very sorry you did, opponent. So, uh, it'll be my turn, where on my turn number five, I will try to mill your, old, uh, mill your deck. Of course, if we brick, there's just no way out, and I can never escape the next turn. <gasps> no, they do have another Fable Passage. Attenzione! So they can actually win this game, maybe, if they have another card. Because they flipped very pretty badly. I'm sorry your opponent has to have to play Shock for two mana in your deck. That's really a shame, but I'm sorry. I'm, so I'm sorry you have to play Shock for two mana. How many cards have left? 22. Ah, uh, yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. How do you spell Attenzione? It's exactly like that. From Kimen. Attenzione. Oh, sorry, with 2T. Attenzione. You're cooking a pot of fusilli and wolf it down with cold marinara. Electrician man, what's the meaning of wolf it down? I've never heard about that. Oh, they play Uro. <laughs> Worst card in standard right now. Not even joking. Actual true right now. Like, among all the cards I could have played, Uru is actually the worst I could have done. Anyway, now, now it's time for us to go off. Ha <laughs> ha, Uru. <laughs> Opponent spam Savage Mana to put a 6-6 into play. That's funny. That's a funny joke. Alright, what are we doing now? It's important now, because... Like, imagine spending 7 mana to put a 6... Alright, alright. Um, uh, what were we doing? Because I can't go... I have a lot of choices here. I have a lot of choices here. I can cast both Ultimatum or I can cast Escape the Wilds first. My final goal is to mill my opponent deck this turn because I don't think I will ever survive next turn because they'll mill me out. Imagine if they don't mill the Ruin Crab and they have to win the game by attacking with Uro. <laughs> Alright, sorry. Sorry for laughing at, at, at the card. Okay, okay. I think I will, uh, I think I will cast Genesis Ultimatum here. I'll put Island into play, mill three, you go to 22 cards. All right, chat, it is, it is time, it is, it is time to spam this crab. It is time to spam this crab. Let's get some porca merda. Take that, shbranabam, and that's, that must be enough, right? That just must be enough. I don't know much, I don't know how much mm, card is that, but that looks like someone is dead to me, opponente. It's turn five, do you think? You think we have enough cards in our deck by turn five? Oh no way! No way! It's turn turn five. You can't have enough lands in your deck. Quanti ce n'hai dieci? Hmm. Dieci. How many basics have left? I've left zero basics. Porca puttana. Allora, allora, allora. How many how many land drops do I have to make here? Hmm. I've I've run out of land drops. That's a bad news. So I can go dry to Blizzian Grove. Ketra Triome. You have now on the Terrachai, on the Katachai? Oh, mm, va bene. Oh, can I? Can I just point out what happened? Can I just 
No, sorry, I just just in case you haven't been following this game closely. Premature scoop? My opponent had four cards in the deck. Anyway, can you imagine what happens if um, if you play Uro? Sorry, can you imagine what happens if you think that banning Uro would solve this problem? Just saying. J just saying. I'm, I play one card. I play one of these cards in the deck just to remind people that this card is still legal. Because maybe if you play zero, be like, oh, they already banned it. No, it's still here, but it's so bad that I don't. I, I, you, I don't. I don't think you should play this card anymore. I think this card is. Uh, it's really obsolete. I think this card is really obsolete. But anyway, jokes aside, actually, that's, that was not joking. Uh, what are we cutting here? Mm, I think I'll, I'll think I'll put in mystical dispute. Um, bo. I, I don't know. Maybe just some glass pool of mimic. Maybe some cultivate because I want to draw. But what bet I? No, I think the 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 solution the solution is to be like sorry, Resendica Rising. We'll just rewind. We'll just rewind the set. Uh, see you next month. We'll uh, we'll release a new set. Is is that fine? I think that could be that could be the the the, the only solution. Yes, we play Blue Land first because the crab. No, I think that, I think, I think that, um, honestly, you know what? I just want to be here, chill. I just want to be here, chill, watch uh, people complain about standard. And uh, I'll just be cubing every day. In this weekend, we I have done nine cubes, actual factual nine cubes with my friends. So that's what I do. I just come here on my stream, play some Pepega standard, mill my opponent deck. Uh, oh, feels like the Zen doesn't have lands, but we actually have two, but they're bad. Wait, am I mulliganing? Nah, come on, we can't mulligan. How, is, how did anybody has ever mulligan? My Zeniker draft went well. We were 11 people. 11 people is a pretty weird number. I think I'm going to mulligan. 11 people is a pretty we uh, weird number, but we were 11 people and uh, we drafted, uh, it was fun. I drafted blue-white. No, I'm a cool man. Imagine scrying on the bottom. Sorry, imagine putting a card on the bottom. All right, um, the question is here though, if opponent plays Cobra, I don't have the spike for Lazard. I think I just, I think I'm just lacking so many tools here that I just ignore if they have Cobra, I'll lose and go to game three. <gasps> no, they play the crab. That's just, that's just, that's just over. That's just it, it's over. I mean, my opponent, GG. It's, it's over, chat. It's over. I hate to repeat it, but yeah, they're just... This card has just no answer. It's like, uh, I don't know, turn one... Uh, What's the one drop that your opponent play and you can see the game? Let me think. What's the equivalent of turn one Ruin Crab? Is it turn one Ether Vial? Maybe maybe it's turn one Ether Vial. Lanor Elf. Go Goblin Guide. Death Threat Shaman. All right, you guys are pointed. Chalice on one. All right, I'll I'll give you that. Chalice on one. Okay, okay. Chalice on one is the closest of them all. No, actually, during the Lurus during the Lurus Spring, one of the most fun moment to play Magic ever in the history of the game. Uh, the the turn one Black Lotus Lurus Black Lotus was was nice. It was the closest thing to turn one Rune Crab. And this game is over. Vabbè, grazie mille, ciao, è stato bello. The also I, I thought about this tonight. I thought about this tonight. Um I thought that maybe the power level of standard right now it's so high 
because they had to balance with uh, the they had to balance it with the companions like the companions the the you know imagine if you have to fight against the just guy luca or lurus decks you know like if you had to fight against those you just um, you just have to You just had to raise up the power level, but maybe maybe it's wrong. Yeah, this is fun. This is a fun stream. I think so. I think this is a fun stream. Aura is not getting banned. I think Aura just uh, just probably the, the 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 tenth best card in standard right now. I could say the tenth, the the tenth best card in standard right now. But banning Lur banning Uru in this in standard is like banning in Virtue of Truth in Pioneer. That will do it just because people will not complain anymore. I think I should mulligan to find Urnus Grab. I think so, yeah. Eh, am I bringing any wilt? Because Porca Putana, this confounding conundrum are hurting me. These confounding conundrum are good. I had it. What did I had? The th the first the first end the one that they again. Hmm. I think I think that will ban crab. I think crab is too strong. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I am joking, and uh, the full the, the whole stream today will be will be about sarcasm and uh, just uh, trying to you know play one time with the strongest deck that the history of the game has ever seen in standard just for one the last time uh you go first um what do you want to do with this end i think i'm keeping you want to mulligan this hand yeah maybe mm, i think i'll slow hold this table passage Yeah, maybe this end should have been a mulligan. Bello, bello lì, bello cobrino, tova bim. All right, cultivate. Oh, don't have mana. That's all right. Okay, so next turn I have a uh, three say cats. I only have I only have six mana. I have to draw a mox now. Uh, even the Chrome Moxes are right. <gasps> Spectre Lizard. And kill Madonna, però. Porca puttana, sta carta. This card has been... Tio caro. Che coglioni. I mean, not that it does anything right now, but... Why don't I have this card in my sideboard? It's like... I've... Like, I've beat three decks... And I've lost uh, the mirror earlier when they played this card post combat, post sideboard. And uh, I'm about to lose this match as well because they played this card post combat. I don't understand why I'm not playing this card. Yeah, yeah, Fable Passage, Noble Turn, I'll do that. I will grab a. Ta -ta -ta Forest. Mm, Spike Field. E allora passo. Ruling Regrowth, ma va là. Over Cultivate. Ah, interesting. Why would you play that over Cultivate? This blue card here is Confounding Conundrum. It's a very good card. It stops the multiple ends coming to play next turn in the same turn. <gasps> no, Ruin Crab. It's over. It's over. No, vabbè, due, ma come due? Vabbè, due crab chat. Dai. <gasps> they don't have land drops, though. Attenzione. Attenzione, because they do not have land drops here. Attenzione. Ah, 
What's their hand? Is it mono counters? Ura Pepega, okay. No, I'm gonna put I'll put in what counter my Genesis Ultimatum. Should I still should I still play it though? Should I still play the Genesis Ultimatum? Exaliora? That's gonna negate. Okay, I think what I'll be doing here is cast his ultimatum. They counter it, but next turn, ideally, they tap out for this Pepega card, and I'll get to resolve the ultimatum. So sweet. I didn't want to exile Ura. I mean, obviously, I didn't think about it. If I if I thought about it, at least I would have thought about it a bit, but I just don't believe that this card is remotely playable. Like, if this card comes into play and attacks me, sure, but that probably means that I lose the game regardless. Like, like the fact that this card exists in my opponent graveyard doesn't doesn't matter at all. But the fact that a land drop from my hand goes away, it does matter. Anyway, here I'm just playing this and hope it resolves. Because if it doesn't, it's over. But for many... Allora, questi qua non sono in gioco. Bueno. Now, I... Now, I have already made a land draw. Or rather, one land came into play already. So, am I playing this Pike Field as already? How many cards have left in the deck? 26. That's, that's plenty. So, I can go Spike Field Azard. And I can bring back um, a Rug Ring Triumph from my hand. Yeah. And uh, now Conundrop helps me. How, JJ? How does it help me now? I can't make additional land drop. I don't understand. Some, 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 some people say that. I don't understand why. Anyway, um, my opponent has 30 cards in their deck. La, I see. I understand now what you mean. I understand what you mean, Chad, now. Okay, 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 okay. I understand it now. So thanks to Confounding Conundrum, now we'll be making extra land drop milling my opponent deck over and over. Oh, more Ura. Oh, that's a shame. Okay. On top of my island. Oh, I can ramp up, man. I didn't think that. I didn't think that. Cats, I could have had, I could have had counter up. I didn't think about that. How many land drops have left here? Probably, I think I have another land drop actually here. No, I ran out. Okay, so I'm passing the turn. Oh, I, I understand now. This is my, this is my first time ever playing against this card with this, with this card. I, I, I'm new to this. So I'm passing the turn with uh, a mystical dispute up in case they cast uh, something. Only two extra with Riot. Yeah, but I thought I didn't make a land but I did. I played this. Okay, okay. It's, make, it's making more sense now. Va bene. They play Omnath. And unfortunately... Unfortunately, I don't have... I mean, Negate wouldn't have done it, but still. I would have loved to have Negate and Dispute up. Because instead of returning this land, I could have done another thing. E questo va bene. I could have had both negate and dispute, that's what I meant. Instead I just returned the top land for some reason. It's not helping my deck, come on. This this card has, has defeated me in the previous games all the time. Every time this card has been cast. Eh, be, you know, let's dispute that. I think uh, the the um, Yeah, they only have one land drop to make. A game for life. Uh I have 17 cards left. You have 21. I think I have to draw... I have to draw something good here. Um, mm -mm. So I'll float mana with that. And uh, I'll return the top land. So I can cycle it. No? Oh, I have to make another land drop, sure. I'll return this Rogrin Triome. I'll cycle it. Ultima to my draw. That's a good draw, isn't it, chat? Um, am I fetching this Evolving Wilds? 
No, because if I fetch, I can't cast Ultimatum. So let's play the Ultimatum here. Am I fetching the land, actually? Uh, how many land drops have I made, chat? That's bad, that's bad, that's fine. I can play this whenever I want. They can return the Evolving Wilds and fetch it. So I'll just play, uh, just play Ultimatum here. All right, we win the game. Imagine... Imagine thinking that Ura was relevant at any point in this game. All right, I'll uh, resolve this confounding conundrum. And I will return all my top land. I don't know how many land drops left I have, but... Also, someone told me to board out Dread of Losing Grove, or not have it in the deck, which is also funny. Uh, they have six cards left, so I will be fetching this Fable Passage. I don't have any lands left, but that's alright, because I have one land here. Thank you, other MTG, for your raid. Welcome, welcome to the stream where we are milling our opponent deck with the strongest card in standard right now. Uh, uh, um, which is uh, Ruin Crab. I have one card left in the deck, but that's enough to make a land drop and kill my opponent. Victory! Thank you, thank you very much, Ruin Crab. I couldn't have done it without you. Ever. I, I I mean, you guys, if you guys have seen those games here, the games aren't about board presence anymore. Board presence doesn't matter. All right, we don't have green mana, but we have a lot of hopes. And remember that one loses the game, one loses the hope. No, I should have got the mulligan probably. This sounds great. I draw forest and uh, I just, I just... Yeah, I think zero crabs we have to mulligan, actually. I have a bad that's mulligan. Alright, this end is incredibly much worse. I have a four drop. <laughs> Imagine playing four drop. Why am I why am I even playing player? I don't know why I'm playing Omnath in the year 2020, but what can I do? Uh, do I bottom a planes? I guess. Maybe a rubber trial. Yeah, yeah. See that maybe it's better. Yeah. Actually no, plane sucks. I have a Jazz ultimatum. It's it would be very funny, chat, if they ban like few cards. Let's say they ban like Ur and Omnath, and I think just nothing happens. I think just nothing happens. Okay, Lotus Cobra. What can they ban in order to stop this deck? It must be like five or six cards. For real. Okay, the second Lotus Cobra. I don't know New Aura, that's a very tough question. I have no I have honestly I honestly do not know. I honestly do not know the answer. Either yeah, let's play this. Let's spike that. I guess I'll do that uh, when they crack this Evolving Wilds. If they do. Lotus, Lotus Cobra and Omnath and for you is good. I doubt. I doubt that that would stop. Lotus Cobra, Lotus Cobra and Omnath. I doubt that that would stop it. I think if you ban like Omnath Ultimatum Escape the Wilds, then that would stop it. But then like you have to ban it like every single time, you know what I mean? Like every single time you print a card draw, you have to ban it. So you, you can ban like actually every card that's in the deck. Except for maybe Ruin Crab. Or you can keep. What, it's play Evolving Wilds and Past? Sure. A, what am I doing here? As always, Omnath does very, very little. I mean, I'm joking about it, but Omnath does do very little. Omnath does do very little, honestly. You cast it's a 4-4, four, four. and maybe next time I can get value off of it. So maybe it is worth it. Yeah, I guess, I guess I'm playing Omnath. Maybe maybe, maybe I draw like a fetch land and I just win the game on the spot. 
Glass boom and uh, I think I will play just to make a land drop. And that's my turn. Yeah, we're 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 back in the we're back in the winter. We're back in winter, chat. I have my I have my water my hot water bottle that was safely safely stood in the closet for the whole summer and now it's already back. Alright, they play Omnath, no land drop. Uh, now I should win the game. Maybe maybe I don't win the game. I don't know if I'll win the game here. So I'll play Omnath, I'll play Co um, Cultivate. No, I'll probably don't win the game. Yeah, I don't. I just twist some lands into play, but it's not enough to cast the, the ultimatum, unfortunately. Because there's this white mana. I couldn't save this, right? I couldn't have done anything different here. Yeah, unfortunately, I couldn't have cast this ultimatum anyhow. I don't. I don't think with cultivate you can. Uh, yeah, I don't. I don't think with cultivate you can choose not to play one into play. I, if I could have put both into my hand, I could have done it. But this card says, uh, and put one of them onto the battlefield top and the other one in end. So if, right, right chat, I can't choose not to choose. No, one is to go and play. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Na comerada. Yeah. So next turn, if I haven't messed up i'll be able to play ultimatum and then win the game unless my opponent will win the game this turn mm. all right and that should be the game sorry for the pounding outside unfortunately i can't can't do anything about it Eh, but but better. Let's just put some some random money in my pool. It doesn't matter. Uh, but I got it. So here I've already I've already used all the previous Omnath. So I'm just gonna choose the new Omnath. Since, uh, yeah, all the ability from the new owner have, haven't been used yet. And I'm just gonna get like, some Greenland. How many cards have in the deck? 32. Um, I still have to make land drops from this. So I guess I am just fetching. So they will, uh, they will activate the Omnath ability. And uh, also get some red mana. Yeah, keep on casting Genesis Ultimatum. I think I will cast Genesis Ultimatum until 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 I'm given mana. And again, the, the okay. The thing is that sure we're putting all nothing to play, but that just doesn't matter. Like we could literally put anything into play. You know what I mean? Like the fact that all nothing exists. It doesn't matter. That's what I'm trying to say today to all the people that think that so banning Omnath would do something. And to the people that think that banning Aura would do something, that's a. Uh, I mean, that's just clearly not really understanding the game Magic the Gathering anymore, but that's fine. I mean, I Oh man, that's you mana, sure, but you have Cobra already. Plus, like, you don't necessarily have to, like, win the game on the spot, you know? You can also just make value and pass the turn. Like, if you play, like, two ultimatums, you're winning the game. The thing is that you're playing the mirror match, so your opponent can't win the game on their turn, but ideally, in a world where the meta game, the, the deck is okay, other people don't only, you don't play the mirror match. See, chat, Andrea says I'm not the world are okay. No, no, I'm not saying that. I'm saying that banning them doesn't change anything. What would you ban? I, it's very difficult. 
you have to ban Lotus Cobra, Omnath Uro, but it's possible that that just doesn't stop it. I mean, Lotus Cobra, it's just, it's tough. It's tough. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I honestly don't know, but, but saying that Omnath and, I mean, saying that, I, mean, I already said about Uro, but I, I think that Omnath at this point is, um, All right, anyway, you should ban, you should probably ban, like, literally all the green cards. If you ban, like, every single green card, you might, and just leave only the, like, Pepega Agro card, only one Uro, yeah, Uro, one Uro, and I, it's here because, I actually don't know why it's here, honestly. Uh, what are we boarding out? I think you should board out one Ultimatum and one Mimic, that's what I've been doing for three disputes. I guess I can board out one Cultivate on the draw. I think you won the gate. Yeah, Crab, uh, Crab is definitely one of them. Omnath lets change for I mean, the thing is that, sure, Omnath was very good in this game, don't get me wrong. But I didn't win the game because of Omnath. That's what I'm trying to, trying to say here. The fact that Omnath was in this game meant that I couldn't break and I just put my deck into play. That's fine. But the fact that I can't just I, I, I can do that regardless with Cobra, you know? Like, if you have Cobra and you go Ultimatum, you can keep on chaining. Yeah, this is the first try. Actually, it's the second try. We have lost the first try in the first in the first round. I think I'm playing Island here to negate their uh, Cultivator Compounding Conundrum. I think Uro might, might even not be banned. I mean, they will ban it, but I think it's not a problem anymore in standard Uro. The power level is definitely definitely too high for Uro. Are you good to post decklist league link? Yeah, you can post decklist league links. I mean, this card is way better than Uro in this deck because you play 35 lands because of the split lands. So it actually ramps you mana, guaranteed, and uh, it also fixes mana, and it also does all the other cool thing. Okay, so I'm untapping here, Spikefield Azard. Hmm. <laughs> I think I'll have to play this tapped and pass the turn. Maybe I wasn't supposed to leave up the gate, I don't know. Rada, va bene. Rada is another cool card. Did you know, guys, that this deck was invented by Javier Dominguez during the early access? Yeah, he had a couple of Rada in the deck, but the deck is very similar to that. He just put together a deck list with Omnath and a bunch of good cards, and um, and he also had Rada. This is the card that seeing less play now. Okay, so listen. People love to use Spike Field as Art Isuero. It's probably one of the favorite play of Magic players. But I'll tell you this, chat. Making this play is bad. Because Uro, what it does is uh, three mana explore, or the new one, the three mana draw a card, gain two life. That's it. Because you're never going to flash it back. Um, so you don't want to make Uro, which is an ex two, three mana explore into a 3-man explorer, discard a card. Okay, chat? Also, my hand was very reactive, and it's just easily going to lose here. The thing is, now, what we want to do, I think I am just playing a top land that passed the turn. Bianco Verde, yeah. I don't think I can tap out. If I tap out to play Omnath, they... I mean, the first thing first, yeah, they just do the things. So I'm trying to play reactively, hoping they flood out. This card can uh, be very good eventually, though. For mana 6-6 six, six Explorer, they have one card in the graveyard. How can there possibly be cold and there be mosquitoes? There's... 
you know, bad things should, should only happen one at a time. Either it's cold or either there's mosquitoes. You can't have both, Paul Kamadoska. I did kill it though. I did kill the mosquito. Because it fell down, but I don't, know where, I don't know where it felt. Must be around here. I smell blood. Porca man, they've played zero spells. Alright, I'll concede to that. <laughs> they've played, I'm gonna board out the gate. Uh, I'll board out the gate. I'm on the play now. Yeah, I do keep in mystical disputes though. So boarded out Uro, Genesis Ultimatum, and one Cultivate. Maybe I will keep the Cultivate. And I will board out. One Mimic. What's a land though? I don't want to board out a land. Alright, whatever. Like for example here, you have 32 lands on this deck basically. Ugin? Ma come Ugin? It costs 8 mana. And it doesn't draw you 5 Rather, sorry. Put the top 5 cards of your deck into play. <sighs> crab, crab, crab. Yeah, we're, we're all about the crab here. We're all about the crab. It's all about the crab. About the crab. I did lose this game. Where did I lose this game? I guess I had too, too, too much of a reactive hand. My opponent just played all the creatures. You can play it with a tomato. That's true. Allora, we're on the play. Dai, yeah. Open the good end, please. Madonna mia. Oh, cool. I don't want to keep this hand. Oh, this is a hand castle. Okay, what do we bought? I'm a spike field hazard. See. See, Vera. Or planes. I think I think I bought my planes. Yeah, this is starting to go. <coughs> I go spike field azard, and then I go uh, mimic, and then if they go cobra, I go end of turn spike field azard, my turn cultivate. Now I can go island. This deck makes you sad, the Tom Tom Hammer? Then you shouldn't watch. You should never watch a content that makes you sad. Porca Kamadoska! I should have left Dispute up to counter that, I guess. Porca puttana! Porca Kamadoska! Porca puttana! Porca puttana, chat. Porca puttana! Porca puttana! I, I, I wanted to go this this on the Cobra, but I guess I forgot about Conundrum. Que palle. Alright, it's fine. It's fine. We'll, we'll, we'll rematch. We'll rematch next league. I, I, I had turn one blue. I had Glass Pool Mimic. Right, so now I can go River Glide Pathway. And I'll pause the turn. Hmm. They don't do much, though. <gasps> Attenzione! Attenzione chat. Attenzione. 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 Now. I'll play crab. I'll play Spike Field Hazard as a land. I'll play Cultivate. 
Why did I even tap this island? Ma perché ho tappato una terra? Ma perché? Or right, actually, I can play this as a land. Bounce this and that. Play this as a... Aspetta un attimo. How many land drops do I have? Only one land drop, right? I think a chat, I don't want to mimic the crab. I do not want to mimic the crab here. So look at Parkaeva was supposed to leave off three mana for dispute. Why did they even tap that island? Alright, I think now I'm I'm now I have to play cultivate. If they dispute this though, it's not a big deal. If they don't dispute this, I can mill them a couple of cards, bring back some lands, so I can make some land drops and mill them some cards. I should have just not tapped the land. I, I thought that I had an extra land drop and I could have returned the land so that I could have done Mimic open up with dispute to, to dispute their dispute. Snake House the Escape the Wild is bad. It's, it's bad especially because I could have avoided this. But also, it's not the worst because if I get some lands, I can just start milling heavily now. I couldn't press Z or because I already made a land drop there. If I draw like a way to get extra land drop into play now, I can't really go off with uh, the crabs because I've dried the Lysian Grove. Cobra. It's a bad draw. It's kind of a shame because I think I, I think I could have done it. It's not over yet. It's not over yet here. I think I'll uh three cinque say I can't gospel mimic the crab because I have to dispute the Kenrith. So I just play Cobra and pass here. Conundrums are good for me if I draw lands. I think it's okay to lose this game. I made uh, I made many mistakes. I made very many mistakes here. I mean, this deck is not easy to play. Whenever you don't play the mirror match, it's easy because your deck is so much better. But when you play the mirror match, it's uh, definitely tough. That's like, it's not it's not technically over yet. I won a very similar game to this earlier, where my opponent had me down with conundrums and I milled them out with crops of strategies and grove. This is the challenge. Yeah, yeah, it's the challenge. Like, you, it's also like a, 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 a thing that's weird is that you have to think about how many land shops you've made, which is weird. It's a weird thought. They're probably going to go land can right here. Wait, land from hand? Yeah, I go dispute. Now, if I draw a fetch land or something like that, I can mill a really lot of cards. Then, so I can go glass pool mimic, copy the crab. Now, play land. This is my first land drop. This is my first land drop, all right? So I'll fetch evolving wilds. Grab a land, second land drop, sorry, still first land drop here. So still first land drop here. And now I'll play a second land drop here, and I'll bounce two lands. So the next turn, I get lands guaranteed. Next turn, I have guaranteed lands. Yeah. So now to go to 19 cards. I, I've made my land drops already, so I have to pass the turn here.
Now they have 18 cards left. They play the ultimatum, so they go down to 13 here, and I can mill 6 and 6, 12. They draw a card now. Oh, they found Ugin. Alright, so that should do it now for my opponent. They found Ugin. Yeah. Alright, good game. I could start milling earlier. No, actually, the difference is that I could have countered the Escape the Wild. If I did a misstep. Although they would have had a dispute up. Yeah, I, I don't know if, if that could have done it. Yeah. Mm, I think I'll f keep playing my lands at least. I can flip like... I don't know. Maybe I draw something. Next turn, though, I will uh, probably lose the game. <clears throat> what pet do I use on Magic the Gathering Arena? It's the pet that they give you with the new, with the new pass. It's just a thing with the jam in the middle. I don't think it's a particularly pretty. I should probably bring back some, some older pet. Storm of Wrath is in the sideboard. I didn't I didn't bring that in. So a way where I can get back into this game is if I go escape the wild crab. Mm, no. Escape the wild then and then win next turn. Opponent will ping me with we're gonna go to 13 and then I'm dead on board actually. Yeah, I think I have no more outs. Alright, good game. Good game. Opponent uh, put up a good fight. I think I will uh I'll slightly change this list. 